today I want to show you how to replace a three single way switch from GE Yasko. Uh, one of the two devices has a blue light here, and this is like the primary, and the other one is kind of called like secondary, and uh, it doesn't have anything. And uh, the and one of the reasons why I'm doing this is because I lost a, a couple of days trying to understand how to do this. But uh, uh, the video that was online, uh, you know, it was like uh, open the box and just like plug and play. But this is not the situation that you have in your home, of course, uh, you know. And the second thing is like uh, 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 I'm not an electrician. So I may use some terminology, terminology that is not correct, but uh, this is not my field. And third, as you can understand, not English, not English is not my native language, and uh, so I'm sorry for that. Anyway, this is the current situation where you are in your home. So you have like a, a standard switch that you can turn on or off the line for both uh, switches. So now, first of all, I want to show you the current situation. So all the wiring that you have in this and how you plug the wiring in these new, different new devices. So, let me take the camera and put the camera close to, so, to the switch. Here is a scenario. This is like uh, my cable from wiring from the, the power that is coming, input. And uh, this is the other one that is going in the other uh, switch. There are difference in number of wires that you have inside. This money has only three from the, the, the power. Yes, one, the black, the white, the black, which is the hot, the, the white, and which is the neutral, and of, of course you have the ground. While this one has like four. So anyway, that's always like uh, set up the standard switch. So you have the important things that you want to remember and you want to before removing the switch. Take the hot wire coming directly for your for your electricity here so remember you have the white the black which the hot the black that which is the hot is connected to the to the to the black screw here so you want maybe put a tape in this black so this is important when you install we replace the switch so let me now remove this uh, switch I forgot to mention before, before we started to work, uh, <laughs> opening the box, make sure that the power is off. You can put uh, the, the primary switch in each of the two box. It doesn't really matter. Uh, it depends on your home. You know that the, the primary has a blue light, so the place that you want to see the blue light is the place that you want to install this device. So when you open the box and you remove the switch, you have a situation like this. So you have the two white, you know, connected together. This is the neutral. And then you have the hot, which make sure to, uh, uh, to mark before removing from the other switch, which is the common. So the black screw, remember before? So make sure that you mark this wire so you know exactly which one is the hot. And then you have the black and red and the ground. So here we are. This is like what you have to do in the primary. So I'm now installing the primary. So you need to have an additional wire. It's better to, you know, to have white. So, you know, and you just connect the white in here. And uh, so the white is gonna go in the neutral. So you are really, in your switch, you are really neutral. Then you have the hot wire that you put in the line. Then the other important thing is that you define which one is the, gonna be the red or the black, which one is gonna be the traveler. So usually I use the red as a traveler. So you put the red in the traveler, and then the last one you put in the load. And then of course, don't forget to set the, the ground in the green screw here. Now I'm going to connect this, and uh, then we're gonna go in the other switch. Let's open the other switch, the which is exactly the same like the previous one. So you have the, the, the uh, black screw, which is the hot, uh, that is going here directly to your light. Uh, so, and uh, then you have the, 
the ground, the other uh, red and, 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 uh, and black, and then you have, of course, your neutral. So, let me remove everything, and I'm gonna show you how to connect to the auxiliary switch. The secondary switch, it's uh, it's even more simple to install because uh, he only has like uh, two wires to, to put. One is the traveler, one is the neutral. So, here really you have a lot. So you need to, so you have the neutral, so again, you need another of this uh, little wire to put here and connect it to your device. And then, uh, you it's important really to put uh, your traveler so remember before that when we define in the other switch in the primary we define which one was the traveler so we define the red as the, as the traveler so you need to put the red in the traveler and uh, you need to put the white in the neutral so red and white connecting what about this two see this two what, what you want to do for this two you really want to put together the two black and uh, I have the other thing. So connect it together. So again, the switch you have to put the ground, the red because we define it in the other one that it was the traveler and again the neutral. So let me do this and then let's see how it works. Okay, here we are at the end. So I just installed both here. So this is the primary, so light on, off, on, and this is the second light, off, on, on, on. So, and, uh, and the, the cool things, of course, I can do from all my devices, also for, from my tablet. So I have, like, I can turn off, on. which is very, it works uh, very well, it's very, very fast, this is like, is an Android application, but uh, I can, you know, I can, I, I, there are applications for iPhone, uh, Windows phone, so whenever, and, uh, alright, thank you so much for watching the video, and I hope that this video helps people like me that are not expert to install this uh, three single way switch, thank you, bye.